with over 8 million visitors each year. The Louvre Museum in Paris is one of the most visited in the world. The collections of Louvre originated in the acquisitions of paintings and other artworks by the monarchs of the House of France. Artworks pillaged during Napoleon Empire got added to the collection. The Louvre Palace is a 12th century fortress which was later the residence of King Charles V. When the royal family moved out in the 17th century, the building was transformed into a place to display the royal collection. And in 1793, the museum was opened. The main entrance to Louvre is the glass pyramid, which was built in 1989. The Louvre contains more than 380,000 objects, of which close to 35,000 objects are being exhibited over an area of 782,000 square feet. The museum exhibits sculptures, paintings, drawings, objects of art and archaeological finds. The Louvre is home for some of the best-known paintings. Leonardo da Vinci's masterpiece, Mona Lisa, is a permanent resident of the Louvre. The painting is a lot smaller than most people think it is. Another famous painting is the Liberty leading the people. Of the 7,500 paintings in the museum, 66% are creations of French artists. Among the sculptures, the most impressive include Venus de Milo, an ancient Greek statue. The seated scribe, an ancient Egyptian sculpture, is quite popular. Despite the missing pieces on the sculptures, the beauty of the work is imposing. The Louvre is so vast that one could easily spend several days exploring it. Assuming one would spend 30 seconds on each piece of art, it would take 100 days to see all the art in the museum even if one spends their entire day and night there. We hope you like the video. But if you are in Paris, do not miss a chance to visit the Louvre. Nothing can replace a guided tour of the museum. We just made an attempt to make your experience better.